Hi everyone. Today, I'm happy to present our work evaluating the impact of uncertainty realization on modal reliance. Nowadays, many work are laborious. As such, AI models have been widely applied to support human decision in highly laborious and repetitive tasks. Let's assume a simple scenario of AI-assisted decision making. If people know that AI provides a correct result, they will adopt it. If people know that AI provides a wrong result, they will reject it. However, these simple scenarios are not realistic, as people usually don't know the correctness of the model predictions. It may be challenging for them to decide to adopt or reject a model prediction. Even model outcomes can have its uncertainty. How would people decide if they are aware of the model uncertainty? Will they adopt it or reject it? Clearly, neither humans nor AI are perfect. Thus, human-AI collaboration in decision-making was expected to achieve complementary benefits, as well as a good collaborative performance. Researchers found that establishing an appropriate human trust in AI is very important for improving the human-AI collaborative performance. Trust calibration was proposed for aligning human trust with the model's actual capabilities so that human can recognize when to rely on model of predictions. Meanwhile, uncertainty was found to increase model transparency, as it shows what models did not know, which can facilitate trust calibration in some cases. As such, we were curious about whether uncertainty realizations can calibrate human trust in AI model. Specifically, we proposed three research questions. Does uncertainty realization help to align appropriate human decisions given a certain level of model uncertainty? Which uncertainty realizations supports better decision given the level of model uncertainty? Which uncertainty realizations has higher perceived trust? Dilt Vost studied the human collaborative performance in a graduate admission task, where participants were tasked to predict an applicant's chance for admission into a graduate school program with or without observing model prediction. Our study built upon Dilt Vost's work and further explored the impacts of uncertainty realization on human AI collaboration during decision making. Except for evaluating human AI collaborative performance, we also focus on human reliance on the model from three aspects. Human choice on model adoption as a behavior measure for model reliance. Free form response for elaborating reasons for human choice. And self-reported trust scales. We included five different realizations in our study, and each participant observed all of those five realizations. Among them, Table and histogram were used for benchmark the effects of other realizations with model prediction, uncertainty information, or both. For presenting model prediction and its uncertainty information, we used the filing plot to convey model uncertainty in a distributional way, and a question mark to convey the model uncertainty in an original way. And we examined these two uncertainty realizations compared to a baseline case where only the model prediction was presented. Except different realizations for model result, our study also considered two different uncertainty levels, low model uncertainty and high model uncertainty. Each participant encountered both uncertainty levels. In our study, the model we built was expected to perform better than a human, and the low uncertainty typically indicates that model performed very well. Also, we deliberately select prediction tasks according to the level of uncertainty for the study. Thus, optimal decisions for participants should be to adopt model prediction when encountered a low model uncertainty task, while reject model predictions in a high model uncertainty task. On the table and histogram conditions, participants observed the raw data for each applicant and made prediction on their own. They were asked to rate their confidence for their own prediction. Under model prediction only conditions and uncertainty conditions, participants saw one of the three realizations and also the raw data table. After inspecting realizations and raw data, they need to choose to adopt model or not, provide corresponding reasons, and raise the confidence for their decision.
Additionally, participants who choose to make their own prediction will ask about the usefulness of the model information as another measure for their reliance on the model. For the overall study process, participants encountered the model performance demonstration phase after passing the tutorial video and quiz. In this phase, they were presented violin plot and question mark realizations with five randomly selected tasks for each realization. For better understanding the overall model performance, they were informed of ground truths during each task and model performance summary at the end of this phase. Besides, tasks were presented in a randomized order in this phase. After training in model demonstration phase, Participants started to do 30 main prediction tasks with five realizations, which actually only consist of three unique high uncertainty tasks and three unique low uncertainty tasks. They firstly saw six tasks under table condition, and then they encountered other 24 tasks with four realizations in a randomized order. In this phase, participants were not informed that they were making predictions for the same six tasks differing only in the realization, and they were not informed the ground truth after each task. Also, tasks were presented in a randomized order in this phase. At the end of the study, participants were asked to complete post-test survey to measure their perceptions and trust level of the model. In order to check whether the results are consistent across different tasks and different participant groups, we implemented a confirmatory study to repeat the study process with the exact same experiment design, but different tasks and different participants. Next, we will report results that are statistically significant for both two studies. By comparing human choice of model adoption under two uncertainty realizations, question mark and volume plot with model prediction owning, we found that uncertainty realization encouraged adoption of model predictions for low uncertainty tasks. When looking at the difference in human choice between two uncertainty realizations, our study observed that in low uncertainty tasks, there is a higher chance that a person, so question mark, will adopt model predictions. While for high uncertainty tasks, rejection of model outputs under question mark condition is more likely. Thus, the question mark representations shows more promise in calibrating trust based on model uncertainty. Also, from participants' self-reported reasons for adopting model, the most cited reason reflected the human trust in AI model through their agreement. Our study observed that, under question mark condition, this reason was more cited by human in low uncertainty tasks, but less cited in high uncertainty tasks while the citation of the reason shows converse trend when people saw wilding plot. This also verified that question mark align human reliance better with the model's level of uncertainty compared to the violin plot. Based on trust survey, violin plot seems to be better rated by participants as promoting trust-related perceptions of the model compared with the question mark, like the measures of confident, reliable, and trust. Except the key findings I just presented, here are some takeaways of our study. There is a certain level mismatch between model reliance behavior and human perceived trust. Question mark leads to calibrate model adoption behavior, while violin plots received higher subjective trust ratings. It may due to humans can be overwhelmed by complex viral information. They may have difficulties in correctly interpret a realization. Future work can be understanding the reason why these two different uncertainty realizations result in different levels of trust, and exploring the appropriate visual design to better align human behavior trust and perceived trust. Presenting uncertainty seems to help align human reliance on model better. Compared to model-only realization, both uncertainty realization promote adopt model in low uncertainty tasks, while reject model in high uncertainty tasks. Our collected reason of human choice also shows that human can recognize the uncertainty level through our uncertainty realization, and the realization can help them make wise choice based on the uncertainty level. We also observed that for a high uncertainty task, which are difficult tasks in our study, some participants adopt model due to the high uncertainty of the model result, but some people reject model due to the high uncertainty. Thus, 
Future work needs to further understand people's intention and the effect of uncertainization when high uncertainty or difficult tasks occur. Lastly, we only tested with lay people in this study, while domain experts may exhibit different behaviors. Study the effect of uncertainization on model reliance for domain experts can also be our future work. This is all for the presentation. Please check our paper through the link below. Thank you.